long as the demonstration remains peaceful, you will be allowed to demonstrate. Once again, as long as the demonstration is peaceful, you will be allowed to demonstrate. They will not stop us from getting the justice that we deserve. It's an attack. It's an all-out assault. Right here at home? On all over the world, in todo el mundo. It's an attack on workers, our, our family, family, our sisters, and brothers. Everywhere. In Colombia, 2,500 brave units brutally murdered. It's the deadliest place on earth to be a union activist. In Jordan, workers sewing clothing for the richest retailer on earth are stripped of their passports and forced to work by slaves. In Liberia, Firestone Plantation workers live in squalor. While enduring back-breaking work for 42 cents an hour. This is what we're up against. Renegade multinationals. Greedy CEOs. And rotten trade deals. Are exporting our jobs at a record pace. It's a race to the bottom. No boundaries. And no border. Pitting worker against worker. For the lowest safety standards. The lowest environmental standards. The least benefits. And the lowest wage. Executive pay is out of control. An average CEO makes more in a day. Than one of our members makes in a year. Global corporations are more powerful than ever before. And they're still trying to break us. Sisters and brothers, this is our obligation. We cannot and will not give up. Goodyear picked the wrong fight on the wrong issue with the wrong union. Victory will be ours because justice is on our side. strangers to tough fights. We've been doing it for more than 70 years. When we fight, I can't guarantee that we'll always win. But if we don't fight, I can guarantee that we'll lose. We're battle tested on Main Street. Now we're fighting on Wall Street. And Bay Street. We're fighting Walmart in Jordan. Corruption in Colombia. Timber bosses in British Columbia. And Firestone in Liberia. 
We took on Verdal in Brazil. On Atasco in Mexico City. We battled Goodyear on the streets of New York. We demonstrated in front of their stores in a hundred cities. We even hit them on the World Wide Web. Now Goodyear is using replacement workers to build it. The fights are tougher and the stakes are higher. We need to hang together to build bargaining power. Every day of my life, I sit at the kitchen table across from the woman who devoted 36 years of her life to my family, and I can't afford to pay for her health care. What's wrong with America, and what will you do to change it? I'm fighting for health care. My parents' health care. I'm fighting to stop illegal logging. To save our paper jobs and the forests. I'm fighting for better safety standards. And secure pensions. We're fighting for fair trade. Safer products. And for worker rights here and all across the globe. Sisters and brothers, we're in the fight of our lives. We owe it to the generation that forged this great union and to those that come after. It's up to us to keep up the fight for a better life. For ourselves, our children, and grandchildren. By building bargaining power. Taking on the tough fights. Standing up for our sisters and brothers everywhere. It's who we are. And why we're still around. We are steel workers. We are steel workers. We're steel workers. We are steel workers. We are steel workers. Nous sommes des métallos. We are steel workers. We are steel workers. The challenge is ours and the time is now.